The old Palazzo delle Albere, the former venue of a historical museum, gives its name to a new district created in Trento from an important redevelopment project. The main idea was to reconnect such an important area with the built urban space. Donating the city an important sign linked to contemporary architecture. When Renzo Piano approached the museum, we started to sketch profiles, in part to recall the Alpine summits, and in part to give a special meaning to these buildings. Clearly, this is also reflected on the other roofings because they are strongly projecting. Musee, Museum of Sciences, is the result of an innovative project on a 116,000 meter squared area. The building has a composite shape following the formal model of the surrounding mountains. The exhibition route goes from ice to summits, from fossils to the subsoil and back. The lack of gravity characterizes the indoor space. Everything is a hymn to lightness. The great transparency and openness allow visitors to write their own history by exploring the museum space. Between science and nature, visitors can live the narration either vertically, following a tale of change in the alpine ecosystems, or horizontally for an in-depth study. Each exhibit is suspended in space and time in a delicately balanced game. Zero gravity is a concept by architect Renzo Piano. The result has been extraordinary in terms of lightness and pleasantness of the exhibition space. The museum is beautiful to live, breathe and perceive, and not only as a scientific medium. Light is not the protagonist. It is a service and we have to adjust to it, measuring and balancing the ratio between daylight and artificial light. The general lighting project of the exhibition areas was conceived in 2007 and realized with Le Perroquet spotlights in different wattage versions. Light creates the shape and allows visitors to read spaces and surfaces. It is a balanced equilibrium between daylight and artificial light that induce visitors to touch the exhibited works. These straw stuffed animals have small LEDs that create a precise lighting effect. The light level is very low in some areas because of projections taking place. Instead, it is very high in other spaces to set off the backlight effect of the large glazed wall that reveals the mountains. The large botanical greenhouse is a living laboratory entrusted with the task of nurturing and preserving a portion of tropical forest. Suspended maxi woody fittings create a special atmosphere at night. Traditionally and especially here, museums are places where investigations are made and disclosed. So scientific publications and international conventions go along with awareness raising actions and cultural mediation. In the labs, light has been designed to fulfill the visual tasks that are typical of these facilities.
In the library and in the administration offices, the use of dark light optics ensures the correct luminous comfort for people working with computers or plunged in reading. C'è questa percezione, lo sguardo verso l'esterno, il rapporto col mondo alpino che the perception and vision of the outside space, as well as the relation with the alpine environment in the valley, make the visit extremely pleasant. La notte crea una situazione. Night creates a totally different situation. Indoor, the museum works also without daylight contribution. Seen from outside, it is converted into a large light box, thus becoming a sign, a call. At night, the valuable heritage of science and knowledge hosted at Muse pervades and evolves the entire district. The extended zero gravity concept is also visible in these buildings. The presence of glazed walls, which are completely transparent on both sides, all around the ground floor, makes the building float with respect to the ground. Eighteen new buildings, 350 housings, offices and stores. The entire district is designed according to modern sustainability criteria, with correct lighting parameters. All lighting fittings integrate perfectly in the architecture, creating a pleasant space. Over one kilometer of arcades, avenues and pedestrian streets is illuminated with state-of-the-art LED technologies at different heights. Uniform light and high energy saving are obtained. The extraordinary architecture of Muse is perfectly integrated in the new district. The correct artificial light makes everything safer and more livable. Muse and the new Le Albere district are now a symbol of Trento at night, a new valued town centre, and a symbol of modernity looking out at the future. <laughs>